Okay, everybody, let's talk chalk pastels. What you need to know about chalk pastels is are they, they are a very messy material. So my hands, I've just used them for a little bit and my hands are already really messy. We're gonna practice doing some blending. Make sure you write down chalk pastels first and that you write the definition of blending. Um, so let's just get started here. I have already started to color in my section where I wanted to do the chalk pastels. Now I would definitely pick an area that doesn't have a ton of details. So if you have some drawings that have a lot of details, I wouldn't use that for chalk pastels. I decided to do this beach scene because I have some bigger areas to color in. Now I've already started and you can see here there's some chalk dust you're welcome to kind of get that off your paper as you're using it. Try to avoid um, making too much dust. You don't wanna do it intentionally. It is really messy and when you're done with this activity for this rotation, I would definitely go wash your hands and then maybe grab a sponge and clean all the dust off your table. Okay, so to get started, I'm just gonna continue coloring in the sun. I would pick some colors close together on the color wheel and um, I'm just gonna start by doing some of this outer edge of the sun with red. I'm working pretty slowly because you gotta be careful. You can't get a ton of details here with the chalk pastels. Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put some of this orange next to the red. Now sometimes you don't wanna blend your chalk pastels. And sometimes, most of the time, I would say you do want to blend. So um, I would just be careful not to over blend. Um, these are really messy. And I would say after today, do not use chalk pastels in your sketchbook. You are just going to want to get a separate sheet of paper. I can show you where the chalk pastel paper is located. Um, for today, for a small drawing like this, it's fine. Um, try to be very careful when you're blending, and if you're really worried about your hands getting too messy, you can try to use a little piece of paper around your finger as you're blending, um, but, uh, you know, it's up to you. I think the finger is, is easier, and then I just wash my hands when I'm done. All right, you guys, let's get started.